Good morning, happy Wednesday. This is Molly Spindler, your faith and fitness motivator. It is What's Your Why and Water Wednesday, AKA Hump Day. And we are in the middle of the work week. Hopefully y'all are having a great week. I know there is a lot of very challenging stuff going on between COVID, um, just everyday life. Good morning and um, the Black Lives Matter issue going on right now. Good morning, Linda. Um, I don't have a lot to say yet because I wanted to stop and educate myself on this. Um, I believe I mentioned yesterday that uh, I have got four biracial children. Good morning, Ashley. Um, hope you all are doing well. Um, and so it may be closer to my heart than you think. Um, some, I don't know. I wasn't raised racist, so I don't know, but I think we all have some form of discrimination, whether it be gender, race, whatever, um, that's been around us growing up, whether we've taken it or not. Um, my grandfather was raised in North Carolina. Okay, he was raised on a tobacco farm. I'm from California. My grandmother was raised in Beverly Hills, California. Like I, that was a long time ago, you know, stuff changes. Um, but what I know that doesn't change is we are God's children. And um, I am going to be educating myself because I want to know if there's some way that I can help so through prayer and education, I will um, hopefully be able to help that situation. Um, anyway, so I wanted to um, also share, I'm still sweaty because I did my workouts just a minute ago and I got to go to the dentist and get a crown. <sighs> ah. uh, first it was a tick on Monday, now it's a crown on Wednesday. Ooh, um, these tough, tough things, you know, I'm not like big into medical stuff, like having medical stuff going on with me or anything really. I just like an easy day, right? I mean, who doesn't? So I'll just shut up. Anyway, um, <clears throat> we've got a coaching sneak peek on Sunday, 8 p.m. Eastern Standard Time. What this is, is a free info webinar where we go online into a Facebook group, uh, just be a fly on the wall, and you get to hear about what we do as coaches. Um, coaching has changed my life, and I've told you that before. Um, I, I scream it from the rooftops because I believe in what I do. I believe in um, what I offer to people, and it changes lives. So I'm not gonna hold on to it because that's like holding a gift and not giving it so I can offer. And um, if you wanna check it out, um, I'll pop you in the group. Okay, just let me know and I'll send you an invite to uh, request to get in the group. Um, and then what happens after that is that um, Monday through Thursday or Monday through Wednesday, we do like a free coaching seminar. So um, you don't have to like show up at a certain time. It's just you come in every day and get the information and we show you what it is that you would be doing as a coach. And that way you can, you know, check it out and go, oh, this is so for me, or wow, this is so not for me. I thought it was something else. Or you just have questions, and there's gonna be a lot of coaches in the group who can help answer those questions. We have got an amazing team of leaders, um, <clears throat> women, and, information, just good information. Um, so I'd love to share that with you. I'm sharing that with you. If you want to um, check it out, just let me know. Um, water Wednesday. Don't forget to get half your body's weight in ounces of water. This is the problem sitting in a little swirly chair. Gotta sit straight like this. Um, half your body's weight in ounces of water and an extra 12 per half hour of exercise. I have only had one 25 ounce so far. I'm working on number two. And um, 
I try to get at least three of those in a day, um, at least three. Sometimes I'm, it depends like, if I'm, if I just have the munchies and I'm not really hungry, I just try to drink water. So I can drink up to like 200 ounces a day. Yeah, that's me. <laughs> uh, why do I show up? You know, I woke up at two o'clock in the morning and I, I don't know what's going on. Maybe I'm trying too hard to sleep or something, but, um, woke up at like two thirty, I think laid there for a while. And then I put my like audio meditations on and um, good morning and laid there for a couple hours um, one of the books I listened to too was um, sleep smarter so working on that and obviously I know I've heard it before is caffeine so I'm kind of getting to a desperate point right now <laughs> like am I gonna get out of caffeine I can try it see if it helps you know um, and he has a process of why and how you do this so I don't know when I'm going to venture into this. Um, maybe I'll start cutting down today and then I won't really have to like completely cut it out. Just, I don't know. Maybe we'll see. I will try not to reinvent the wheel. I will just do what he suggests. Um, I know I drink more than I need to. I don't drink as much as some do, but, um, obviously something's going on. Like see how my, my cheeks are so red. I used to, I've always gotten like this. Like I'd be out on the soccer field and it's hot outside and I'm running and my cheeks just get really red. So I was told that my blood vessels are close to the surface of my skin. Um, and then when he was talking about caffeine, he was talking about how like when you stop drinking caffeine, like the blood vessels, like blood rushes to it or something. So I don't know if that's what's going on here. <laughs> Along with just, I don't know, I've always had that. So I don't know, I'll keep you posted on that. What time did I start? Did I start about 8.30? I think I did. Um, yes, what's my why? What's your why? My why is um, so I did not sleep great. Nope. I just got up anyway and I'm not going to sleep in because I've got stuff to do. I've got work to do. I've got to show up for my coaches, for my challengers, um, for myself. So if I don't get my workout in first thing in the morning, I'm not going to get it in most likely because the day just, you know, goes yesterday. Kyle graduated. Yay. Can't believe it. He's out of high school now. Wow. Yeah. So we're like, Megan, Haley, and Kyle have graduated. Next will be Owen, Addison, then Evan. Why am I doing it like this? I really don't know. Um, yeah. Yeah. So Owen's got two more years. Addison's got five? Four. She... He has, I don't know, let's see, he's got two, she has an six, seven, eight, nine, ten, eleven, twelve. 10, 11, 12. Oh my gosh, Evan has seven, so she has five, Owen has two, two, five, seven. Okay, I'm just learning how to count. Um, yeah, so we're halfway there, right? Yeah, yeah, Kyle got accepted to VCU, and um, he'll be starting the arts program this fall, I don't know if they're going to be having online classes or if he'll be actually on campus. So I need to see, I guess, registration opened up yesterday and I'll see what he found out. Um, I will be sharing pictures from his graduation. Hopefully they'll be able to do one again in August before all the kids get off to college. Uh, they're supposed to, they're talking about like August 10th or something. So, um, hoping hoping um because that would be extra special but in the meantime you know we just roll with the punches right okay so if you guys have any questions about the coaching sneak peek on sunday let me know or if you just have any questions in general about the online challenge groups um first and foremost we are challengers i'm a challenger i've got a coach 
I don't know everything. None of us do. So, right, Linda? Good morning, Lizzie. Um, Linda is like one of the best online friends I've ever had. She's a special lady and I really appreciate her. Uh, she's also one of my challengers. Yeah, life is good. Life is good. All right. Um, let's see. I think there's one more thing I was going to talk about. Um, I think that is all. I think that is all. If I forgot something, I will post it in the title. And I hope you guys just have a good day. And I hope that you all are staying safe. Um, there's a lot going on. There's a lot going on. But that's okay. My God's bigger, so he's got it. Put my faith in him. I'll shut up, get my post-workout, and go get my crown. <laughs> All right. Love y'all. Have a great Wednesday.